And we've had some fantastic presentations in our plenary lectures and also in our individual contributions from uh, other scientists. I think if I had to say what the highlight was, it's actually the enthusiasm that you feel around you all the time and the opportunities for networking and you can hear the buzz around me now of people in conversation about their science and the passion for that science. It's a chance every year where the family of physiologists can get together and it is important obviously to communicate science but it's important to connect with your colleagues too because it is the things around the fringes of the society where you get new ideas for experiments, you get feedback that you typically wouldn't maybe get with a manuscript uh, as you're starting to evolve an idea for, for publication. We've had undergraduates giving talks which have been fantastic, we've had really senior scientists giving some superb overviews of their work, so it's actually that kind of ability for everybody to showcase, but it's also about the fact that physiology is so diverse, so we're looking at all the different systems and it's the ability to be able to apply the knowledge that you'll learn from one talk and actually think about how to apply it into your own research. It gives a platform for early career researchers to kind of show their work and what they've been doing, um, but also gives you a chance to see kind of experts in their field and the science that they've been doing. I think this Physiology Conference is an important event because it's really dedicated to physiology. Because physiology is integral to all sorts of biomedical sciences, and so we can cover a huge range of subjects, but we're really concentrating on biological mechanisms.